it's heating up. So I think it's going to heat up all the way to 315. Then I can just glide it. Oh, it's already warm. I can feel it. And it's cute or whatever. But she couldn't name one. Okay. Okay. I'm going to have to look it up for her. It's Highway to Hell. Sing it, Jack. Highway to Hell. It is Saturday. It's about 8.30 and we are already behind schedule. We should have already been up. We have a long list of things that need to be done today, including y'all little internet niece has her own little itinerary. Her best friend is having, her mother's giving her a surprise party. So I need to make sure that she's with me so that she can be where she needs to be on time. Um, and look at her. Stayed up all night. I heard her down here, and baby, I, I I went and got me some Z's. I heard her down here all night long, cackling, laughing, and all kinds of stuff. But anyways, um, I too have a lot of things on the agenda for today, and I hope I can make everything that um, I've committed to. Um, Y'all know how I do. I try to support everybody, and so today, I, yeah, today is just that's all I can say. Today. Is, Anyways, I got to um, start my Saturday off with my morning workout. Y'all know that's what I do every Saturday. So, uh, yeah, let me get her up so that we can uh, get this day started. All right, y'all. So, I am done at the gym. Your girl is dressed. And I am ready for my first outing on this good old Saturday. Y'all niece has already left to go to her little shindig. And she got a number of stop stops for today. Um, they'll be in Chinatown and then I think the stop ends at Katie Mills and this was a surprise party for one of her good friends so she got her stuff going on and now I'm headed to my first stop which is Keys Brunch so it is at a place called Gotti's I've never been to Gotti's before so I'm praying that the food is amazing because I'm hungry and then um, later on this evening I want to stop and peep in on Drea and Lou they're having a meet and greet at Gaia, so I'm going to stop and peep in and see what they got going on. But um, yeah, I, do y'all remember when I bought this? I bought this off of. If you don't, I bought this off TikTok shop. This is a portable heated straightening comb or straightening brush. Okay, I would say I would use it more for a middle part bust down long unit. But I'm gonna try it on this. Um, Bob because this Bob was giving me hell at the house. I had flyaways. I had all kinds of stuff going on and um, I put the Bob on before I had my makeup done. So I'm going to use this once I get to the location. So I'll give y'all my honest review on this little TikTok shop straightening brush uh, once I have my first experience with it. But I need to put in the address in my GPS because I don't know where the hell I'm going y'all. So I'll be back. I brought this because we got to look look like a long walk on our hands look let me tell our friends family loved ones if you have an any event downtown I, and you're not going to shuttle your guests in just go ahead and take me off the list because to park closer to the restaurant $30 $20 and then we finally we, as you come further away from the restaurant the price of parking goes down I told you I have a problem with uh you know paying too much to park i just I, I i can't all right so we didn't cut it on it said 315 it's heating up oh, okay i think it's, it does a little countdown can y'all see that oh it's getting it's getting warm it's heating up t blaze it's like 20. Like 20? uh-huh right here for five hours i don't want to be here for five hours come on b that's like Kim Hong. Who is she? Oh, we in her parking lot. 
She making money off the parking lot now. Yeah, I don't want to be here for five hours. Yeah, we try to figure this parking lot. But it's heating up. So I think it's going to heat up all the way to 315. Then I can just glide it. Oh, it's already warm. I can feel it. Okay. All right, girlies. Y'all might need one of these. Oh, hold on. Let me see. Okay. I happen to like this. Now all I, now all I need is a portable flat iron. I'm, uh, yeah, flat iron. Okay. And it's, it's heating up. We at 252. What are we going to do? You want to park here? I just texted him and said, me and Jay are still riding around looking for affordable parking. Okay, well, get back in your car. Teddy's about to fall out. They got <laughs> Maybe I can get some free parking. <laughs> Bust the windows Baby, we done done. found a good parking spot, but this is a good you need to keep moving. Look, somebody what? hold window. Somebody hold window. Come on, man. Tori got, Tori got all her legs out. Y'all, Tori out here being yeah, fast. Yeah. But look at her. Look at, yeah. look at Bo. Come on, Bo. Don't look at that cellulite now. Don't y'all worry about that. <laughs> I can't leave my car here with somebody window sitting right here. I know. Is that, is that under boob you got? Oh, my God. Make sure go home. Yeah, we are walking, walking to brunch. Look, okay. look, I got the one we celebrating and this one. In the blue. But why are we celebrating? We are celebrating you, ma'am. This is your celebration. I asked y'all what's the ACDC song. Because I have on an ACDC shirt. And it's cute or whatever. But she couldn't name one. And so I can't. look it up for her. It's Highway to Hell. So sing it for her. Yeah, Highway to Hell. 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 Number one, let's let's go to the time. Brunch started at 2.30. No, 3.30. Our reservation was for 3.15. Give us oh, some credit. Three, oh, okay, 3.15, excuse 315. me. I thought it was 3.30. No. Oh, so it I is still, currently... I still left my house too. Oh, shit. It is currently 4.01. It's 4.01? It's 4.01 and we still trucking. And it's going to be... Uh, I'm sweating from every crevice on my body. It say one minute, but it's going to be 4.05 by the time we get there. <laughs> Cause we moving at a turtle's pace, you hear me? That's what somebody, I have on tennis shoes. I put my dunks on. This one to the right of me has on wedges. And so, do, it's So Saturday. she's tipping down the sidewalk. And damn. See y'all inside. All right, y'all, we finally made it in here. It's cute in here though, it's cute. Too many, fooling with Sony. 
And look at her with the glasses on. Look like Terminator. Did she talk about the Casamiga Tower? Oh, we had a Casamiga Tower. Bitch. Yeah. Oh, we're going to have to Come on. Come on, you're stomping with the big dog. You're stomping with the big dog. She said she's going to be sick. This a mother and daughter duo, y'all. Come on, tap it. Oh. Come on, up to it, down to it. Down to it. Fuck do do it. We're tired of doing it and we used to it. We ain't used to it. Come on, T Blaze. Oh, no, it's not. But you can just keep it going. I got you. Good morning, y'all. So it is Sunday morning, and this is going to be one of those situations where I'm ending the vlog on the same day that I'm beginning a new vlog because yesterday was rough for you, girl. Last night was rough, okay? Um, but I got to give y'all a recap of everything that transpired on yesterday. So yesterday, 
um, as far as the venues, everything was nice. Gotti's nice venue. It's a smaller venue. Um, but when I tell you, like, the waitresses, the hostesses, the DJ, the kitchen staff, everybody was so friendly. Everybody was so personable. Um, I mean, it, it was an enjoyable time. The only thing that I had an issue with and if you choose to um, visit that location, just make sure nothing else is going on down there in that area. Because unbeknownst to us, there was, um, I guess the Dynamo team here is going to the playoffs or whatever, or was playing or something like that. So it was a bit more crowded than usual. Um, and we were confused because we were like, the Astros is out of the, uh, you know, running, they lost. So we were a bit confused as to why it was so crowded down there. So. When it's crowded, it becomes an issue with parking. Now, if you can find meter parking along the street, you good. That's two, three dollars for two, three hours of, you know, you going to enjoy yourself, that's fine. Um, where we initially parked, the meter was covered up by a, like this blanket type deal, which we assumed it was, okay, well, it must be free parking, it's the weekend. So once we walked to Gotti's, which was about two blocks from where we parked, um, I asked the lady that was working there and she was like, no, that means you can't park there. And when I tell you the Houston Parking Patrol was out on yesterday, they were out giving tickets. They will immediately put a boot on your car and your girl wasn't finna chance that. So I ran back and got my car and luckily found meter parking right in front of the establishment. But that's the only downside. You know, and I've said this before, if you plan to come to Houston and you plan to party within the city um, or downtown or somewhere in those areas, just be prepared to pay to park. Um, if you're looking for venues where you are most likely not going to have to pay to park, go to Katy, go to Mo, Mo City, go to Sugarland. Those are areas where you could possibly find, you know, somewhere to have you a nice drink, a few wines or something like that, and you're not going to have to pay to park. But if you're going anywhere, like I said, in Third Ward, downtown, South Park, areas, just be prepared to pay anywhere from $20 to $40. So your best bet is to either Uber in, which possibly could be cheaper, or um, carpool, okay? So after we left Gotti's, we went to Little Woodrow's, which was right down the sidewalk from Gotti's. That was extremely nice too. B mixed crowd, huge venue, air-conditioned venue. Um, they had a patio that had, you know, like the little games that y'all saw, um, the little carnival slide y'all saw. So that was an enjoyable time too. Um, now your girl didn't get on that slide. Not because I was afraid to slide. I was afraid my beautiful headpiece was going to fly the hell off. And that I can't allow that to happen, okay? I wouldn't get on that slide and taking a risk of my wig staying up there as I was down on the ground. That wasn't going to happen. Um, I've experienced that before and uh, yeah, it wasn't going to happen. Um, and then after we left there, we went to Drea and Lou's event, which was at Gaia. Um, I've taken you out of Gaia before, and that was an enjoyable time. I got to meet several subscribers, and that was really, really nice just to come face-to-face -face with those who usually watch you, you know, on the screen, um, and they were extremely nice, very personable. Um, we got to take pictures. I think the furthest person um, that traveled to come um, to their meet and greet came from Atlanta, Georgia. Shout out to Atlanta, um, which I will be traveling to Atlanta very soon. Um, but it was really, really, really nice. I can't say I truly enjoyed myself. Now, what took me down, I think, and that's because I hadn't eaten and I had already worked out, was at Casamigos Tower. I had a Casam I had a two glasses or two cups of a Casamigos Tower. Y'all know my tolerance for alcohol is extremely low. So this morning, um, and then I had some, a few drinks at uh, Gaia. This morning, I woke up with an excruciating headache, like. It took me a minute to get myself together. Like, I think I sat in my bed just staring at the ceiling for about an hour before I just decided to get up and get mama together and go wash clothes and things like that. Because y'all know Sundays I have dedicated to cleaning house, taking care, stripping beds, washing sheets, and all that kind of stuff. But um, today, on the itinerary, which would probably pick up on the next vlog, um, I am supposed to meet up with Arthur Bestie and Tanya. We're going to brunch on today. Um, and 
they did not tell me a venue we didn't even solidify a time so with that being said i just have to say stay tuned but i think i'll go ahead and end this vlog right here um so i can pick up the next vlog again i hope you guys enjoyed all the footage i truly appreciate all my supporters i can't say that enough um and we growing y'all we are growing and i'm so thankful to the most high for it and uh yeah so until next vlog love you guys Oh,